Um, I'll tell you what, though. What You know what you said about Twitter, the, the fact that they're on it. You know they're on it too much just by the, the evidence being that Ash Sarko mm. ends up on Politics Live and Newsnight oh, and no. documentaries. Because for, for an extremist like that, for a communist, the most bloody political movement of the 20th century, for someone to be sat there and just openly like saying, yes, I am a communist. And for the BBC to fund a, a three minute documentary to introduce her before she comes in talking about a communism as a, as a thing. And, and I'm like, to, to, to any normal person that isn't on Twitter, you know, 18 hours a day, you might as well have a Nazi sat in the seat. You might as well. Just like I said, like I said on Twitter, you know, just like, well, we've 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 ironed out the genocidal bits. We we focus more on the the looking after your country side of things now. That's how it looks to me. Well, and other see, people. There was a Jewish MP, uh, a lady, and she said, you know, like, no Nazis deserve their heads kicking in. <coughs> and a lot of people, like, yeah. And uh, some people pointing out, like, you know, she means like real ones, not just everyone you think's a fucking Nazi. She means skinheads beating the shit out of Jews and black people and Asians and shit. That's what she means. And when put in that context, I'm like, yeah, fair enough. Whatever, yeah. Go and, if you're going to go and do it, go fill your boots. You know, yeah. get your teeth right out the fucking head. It's fine by me. But all these pricks on Twitter, I'm thinking, you're putting too many people in that Nazi group. That's a lot of heads you're going to have to kick in. And also, most of the people that say they're going to go and beat up a Nazi are people like the guy we know who couldn't knock the skin off a fucking rice pudding. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. frightened of confrontation. Well, Unlike, the, the, ironically, most Nazis. Yeah, I know, yeah. You can't even look someone in the eye and you're going on about <laughs> punching fascists. It's like, all right, mate, yeah. What cool. was it he was on about the other day? Uh, well, you know, we got to hold our MPs uh, feet to the fire, which is the next best thing to a violent uprising. I know, yeah, violent uprising. Fuck violent off. Uprising, it's, yeah. Here's the thing, man. That, that, that's that's the thing now. They're calling the Tories fascists. They're calling the people that voted for them fascists. Completely misunderstanding the whole point of a democratic vote. Do you know what I mean? It's insane. Uh, uh, a cup of tea said, G and H, did you vote conservative? No. No, I didn't. No, no, I've I never voted myself, conservative in my life. I'm never um, going to. No, I didn't. But I, but I did think it was hilarious that they won. Graham only votes for the far right, guys. Come on, you know that. He's still I, disgusted he can't vote for the National Front. I just wrote Tommy Robinson at the bottom. Myself. Hitler. Tommy. He just, he just wrote Hitler. Adolf Hitler. A little doodle of a... Of a... 